Here's an application of dot product, work done. A father pulls a child in a sledge with 150 Newton force at an angle of 30 degrees to the ground. How much work is done over a 2 kilometer walk? Let's say that is the ground, right? And this is the sledge kind of thing, okay? Father is pulling at an angle of 30 degrees to the ground. So let's say that is 30 degrees to the ground. So what we are saying here is that the angle is 30 degrees. Now work done is in the horizontal direction. So we have to take the component of force which is along the ground. That is kind of important and that is the reason why when we do work done we have the formula as work done W is equals to force dot distance, right? Force dot distance, let's say D, right? So we say work done equals to force dot distance. So if work done is W, force is F, and D is the distance, then work done is force dot distance. Force dot distance means magnitude of force times magnitude of distance moved times cosine of theta, the angle between the force applied and the distance it is moving through. Now cosine theta as you can see is a horizontal component, correct? So that makes sense. Now what we are given here is force of 150 newtons. So we we'll write force of 150 newtons. So I mean okay. And angle is 30 degrees and distance is 2 kilometers. So we need to write distance in meters. So which is 2000. Absolute value I'm just writing in cos of 30 degrees. So calculating this gives us the answer, right? So we can use the calculator. So we have 150 newtons, which is 150 times 2000 times cos of 30 degrees. That gives us square root 3. Okay, so let's change to decimals to get our answer. So we have 150 times 2000 times cos of 30 degrees which is 259807.6 right. so so those many newton meters newton meters correct so we can just write this as 259808 newton meter right so that is the work done in this particular case i hope that's clear Thank you and all the best.